Hi guys, my name is Anne and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're gonna do a review on the Shayla Tom Colourpop collection. This collection includes one 16 pants eyeshadow palette. It's called Perceptions. Two loose highlighters. Three luxe lipstick. And one ultra glossy lip. And the whole collection retail for $59. I'm gonna give you some swatches and some demo. If you're interested in seeing how this collection looks like, please keep watching. Beautiful. You open this up, it has a good side mirror. And the name of these shades are actually on the palette itself, so you know what shade that you're gonna use. And the shades that you can go from day to night. And the back of the palette, it has the name of the shades in the back of the palette. It's just so compact and it's so lightweight. These are the swatches for the eyeshadow palette. These are the swatches for the three lipstick and one lip gloss. And these are the swatches for the loose highlighter. I already prepped my eyes with some concealer and I already set it with some setting powder. So now I'm gonna go straight to the eyes. I'm gonna start with culture as my transitions. This is a really nice transition. It's the close to my skin tone but I just want to uh, have it there to prep for any other shadows go on top of this culture is the neutral transition shade I love it because it's not too warm it's not too cool we just gonna build the intensity of the crease and I just build up the color I love a transition shade that you can build it up because I don't want to go too harsh at first. Next, I'm gonna go to this color right below it. It's thick right here. And I'm just gonna run thick over on top of culture. Next, with my MAC 217, I'm gonna go to Revenge and I'm, go I'm just gonna uh, intensify the crease. I'm not gonna blend this one as high as the other two shades. Now that I have revenge on my crease, I'm gonna go back to my first brush and just blend it out because I don't want any harsh light. I got to say, of this blending, I don't have any fallout underneath my eye and everything blend out so easily. Now to darken my uh, outer V a little bit, I'm gonna go to play out with my Morphe M506. Just dip it in here and I'm just gonna darken my outer V. And I go back to my first brush and just blend everything out so I don't have any harsh line. For the lid, I'm gonna go with IE right here. It's a gorgeous olive green. And I'm gonna actually use my finger with this. It's so beautiful. Wow. Wow, unbelievable.
with this color even with my finger and I'm using it dry I don't have any fallout underneath right here I'm loving this Ooh. oh wow oh my gosh I'm gonna use my MAC 242 and I'm just gonna clean up the line I really love this it's it's so gorgeous it's go on so easily and no fallout that's the best part no fallout now I'm gonna apply whatever on top to my bottom lashes I'm gonna apply play down with my Morphe M432 with my pencil brush this brush is MAC 219 I'm gonna use Revenge and I'm just gonna kinda blend this out and connect to the top part with my Morphe E36 I'm gonna go to thick and just gonna blend everything out I'm gonna use unbutter and highlight my inner corner really loving this I'm gonna apply my liner and my lashes and then I'll be right back hi guys I'm back now I'm gonna finish my face I'm gonna start with D2 loose highlighter I have one is booming and one is pose pose is a little bit of a darker for my skin tone but I can use this one as my uh, bronze, bronzer topper but today I'm gonna use uh, Booming and I'm gonna use this with my Morphe M10 and I'm just gonna apply this in the high point of my face Wow Oh my god, do you see this? Oh my god, it's It's really booming Wow, it looks really good Wow, and I did not go like really heavy handed with this. I just tapped really tiny of this products and oh my god. I'm gonna go this right here. A little bit of this go a long way guys. Wow. A little bit of my the bridge of my nose. And a little bit of my cupid bow. So now I'm gonna apply the lipstick for you to see. First, I have Come On Sis. It's really pretty. And I'm just gonna apply Neat Freak at the center of my lip. Next, I have ooh. And then I'm going to apply neat freak at the center of my lip as well. Last but not least, I have cookie. I 
I'm also gonna apply neat brick on this new quickie. So that is it you guys, this is the complete look. I really love how this turned out. This is what I think about this collection. The eyeshadow palette, I really love that it's playing out so beautifully. I have no fallout. Everything just go on so smoothly. And with this palette, I can go really from day to night. And it's so compact and it's really good to travel as well. As far as the loose pigment highlighter, I really love this. It's not chunky, it's not glittery, it just gives you like a really wet look. And you can apply this on top of your eyeshadow as well. I really love these. As far as these three lipstick and the gloss, they are so creamy. It's not sticky, it's really light, it's really comfortable on the lips. I really love this. As the whole collection, I definitely recommend this collection. You get one 16 pounds eyeshadow palette that can go from day to night. You get two loose highlighter, three lip lock, lipstick, one gloss, and you get all of this for only $59. It's just really reasonable really cheap and the quality is just top notch i really really highly recommend this collection that is it for my video let me know in the comment down below if you like this collection have you tried it out i hope you like this video if you do please give it a thumbs up i really love it when you do and before you leave, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so it can let you know when I upload a new video. I hope you have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!